welcome viewers if still you're not subscribed to this channel kindly subscribe and also click the bell icon to get technology updates regularly on this JP Infotech channel hi in this video we are going to see about a python project which is entitled as traffic accident risk prediction using machine learning which is an IEEE 2022 conference paper so before seeing the execution of the project let me brief about this project we all know that traffic accident that is road accidents or uh, increasing day by day and those are the major cause of the deaths and disabilities and hospitalization etc so to prevent this accident the traffic accident risk prediction is important to minimize these kinds of issues and to save the human lives so there are several kinds of models that have been proposed in the earlier and even in our project list we have a accident risk prediction model but a different model and different data set and in this project we have used a different data set which consists of latitude and longitude as an important feature which was not done earlier and in this paper the authors have made this traffic accident risk prediction using machine learning where they have made a survey based on the different techniques and they have listed all the technique methodology and with the advantage and disadvantages so we cannot implement all the algorithms or model so as our proposed model we will be implementing the traffic accident risk prediction using the random forest classifier and uh, our training accuracy that we have achieved is 99 percentage and the test accuracy that we have achieved is 88 percentage and now coming to the important part that is the data set part so this is a UK data set so this data set is somewhat bigger data set so for executing this project you must have 16 GB or 32 GB of RAM in your system so that may be not be any problem or else you will be having some memory issue while executing the project so make sure of that only because of this data set and here you can see the data set with the attributes of ID, accident index, road class, road number, second road class, second road number, accident severity, carriage way, hazards, date, day of week, did police officer attend scene of accident, junction control, junction detail, latitude, light conditions, local authority, district, local authority, highway, location easting OSG or location northing OSG or longitude, LSOA of accident location, number of casualties, number of vehicles, pedestrian crossing, human control, pedestrian crossing, physical facilities, police force, road surface, condition, road type, special conditions at sites, speed limit, time, urban or rural area, weather conditions, year in Scotland, age, band of driver, age of vehicle, driver home area type, driver IMD diesel, engine type capacity CC that is hit object in carriageway, hit object off carriageway, journey purpose of driver, junction location, make, model, propulsion code, sex of driver, skidding and overtoning, towing and articulation, vehicle leaving carriageway, vehicle location restricted lane, vehicle maneuvering, vehicle reference, vehicle type or vehicle left hand drive, first point of impact and year. So these are the which is the available in the data set and you know we are going to use only few features and uh, we'll be predicting the uh, accident type so here we have we've been classified in the accident type as three class that is slight serious and fatal and uh, if you scroll down till the end of the data set you can find the data set record consists of around 10,166 data set record so there are number of features is high and that is the reason I said you that you need to have a higher RAM configuration for executing this project and also before execution make sure that you have fulfilled the requirement that is mentioned in the requirement file with the exact version of the Python and the library is installed in and now let us see the execution of the project now how go to your command prompt before the copy the source code location and in the command prompt go to the source code location and then type python app.py and click enter and kindly wait for a few minutes uh, 
and now you can see the URL there are few warnings but there is no any error in it so just copy this URL go to any of your browser I am going to Firefox because when I have tested in Chrome the Chrome was crashing due to the memory issue so I am going to the Firefox right now and just pasting the URL and now you can see the home screen I will consider the project with the project title traffic accident risk prediction using machine learning and now you can just see the login menu just click the login menu and it will be navigated to the login page just enter the default username and password as admin and admin kindly note that this is a uh, this is a the static login page because we have not used any database in the project so just enter the default username and password as admin and admin and then click the login button and once the login is successful you can see the login success message and click ok now it will be navigated to the upload part so in the upload part you need to select the data set so just go to the project folder and you can find the upload.csv file so just select this upload.csv file and then click the upload button and kindly wait for few minutes because it will be the data set is larger one so it will be loading into the web part so kindly wait till the loading is completed So now you can see the loading is completed and the data set has been updated in the preview part of the, our browser. So just scroll down till the end of the page and you can see the complete data set has been loaded into the preview page which consists of around 10,166 data set records and just click this click to try not test button. Now after few seconds you can see the training finish message and click OK. Now it will be navigated to the important part that is the prediction part of the project. Now let us see the first case with a latitude of 51.496345, longitude of 0.206443 band of driver is 46 to 55 and uh, sex of driver is male vehicle type is taxi private car hire road type is single carriageway speed limit is 30 junction control is data missing or out of range light condition is daylight weather condition is raining no high winds road surface condition is wet or damp and urban or rural area it is urban and let us check the prediction result for this case by clicking the predict button and you can see the prediction result is slight so slightly injured will occur so drive carefully so we have three classes here slight serious and fatal so now I have shown you with the case of slide so let me click the prediction menu again so check with the other case so now let me enter the latitude that 51.514787 and longitude of minus 0 0.195197 age as 36 to 45 and uh, sex of the driver is male and vehicle type is car and road type is single carriageway speed limit is 30 junction control is auto traffic signal daylight light condition is daylight and weather condition is raining no high winds and road surface is wet or damp and urban or rural is urban and now let us check the prediction result for this by clicking the predict button and you can see the prediction result is now serious so seriously injured will be occur so drive carefully so now let me go to the prediction menu again to show you the next class with the latitude of 55.237 969 and longitude of minus 4 point two nine nine six nine six and age band of 
driver is 46 to 55 and if so driver is male vehicle type is car and road type is single carriageway speed limit is 60 junction control is data missing or out of range and light condition is daylight and weather condition is 5 no high winds um, road surface is dry and urban or rural area it is rural now and now let us check the prediction result for this and you can see the prediction result is fatal and death will occur so drive carefully so I have shown you with the three cases that are slight, serious and fatal you can also check with the other from the data set that you are given in the test folder or in the data set that you have trained up with so you can check with the other cases of the data from the training or test data so we have three classes I have shown you with the each case now and now let us move to the next part that is the performance analysis parameter so in the performance analysis parameter we will be seeing about the recall F1 and precision value so as I said you three classes with the uh, slide series and fatal those recall F1 and precision values have been shown and the confusion matrix for the true and the pleated labels of it and final comes the chart part so as I intimated earlier we are not used any database in the project so we cannot show a dynamic graph here so it is a static graph so this graph is manually plotted with the data set that we have trained up with so which consists of slight of 40 percentage and the series as 30 percentage and fatal as 30 percentage of data set record that we have trained up with and now let me log out and this is all about the project traffic accident risk prediction using machine learning and thank you for watching